Uh, so we are Josephine Josephine Banksy, Banksy. Uh, and all we need to get started is a word. Fragrant. Shoes. Fragrant. Fragrant. Okay, so this reminds me of a story about what I used to do in fourth grade. Um, because I didn't know how to like make friends or fit in like a normal kid. So I would do, um, I watched the show Laverne and Shirley. I don't know mm -hmm. if you guys are familiar with it. Mm -hmm. And I would do this impression that was like sort of like half of a squiggy impression, but like, like half, half my own a, thing, like half a water Squiggy, button. who is a character. Okay. I think it was Squiggy. It could have been Skiggy or like Squiggy. 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 Thank you. Squiggy. It was definitely Squiggy. Um, and and I would go up to kids in my fourth grade class and I'd be like, hey, blank. Um, so, so I would say like, hey, Jord I'd be like, hey, Jordana, you smell like a sewer. So what you gonna do about it? Take a bath? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so it was me. <laughs> and I thought it was like super funny. And, and, and I was like, I was like the really quiet, like weird girl who like, that was my only thing was like doing impressions. And like, that's like how I got validation from my fellow fourth graders. And one time I did it to like the wrong kid in my class. And then I got like a real sit down by my teacher that was like, you can't tell people they smell like sewers. <laughs> like, I know it's a bit, but like you can't do that. Um, and yeah, and I haven't learned from it. And I've been doing it ever since. <laughs> you still tell I still do, that. I'm doing that impression to this day. <laughs> Yeah, I, I do smell like a sewer. I can't, I can't afford a shower. Why did you say that to me? Oh my god! I can't afford to, to get a shower. <laughs> Tim, this is why I wanted you to confront her. Okay, Tim. Tim. Tim, your bits have gone too far. Tim, how could you say that to me? You know for a fact that I lost my job. I've just been living at home. And I've been, I've been just getting that little hand soap and putting it on under my armpits. You smell like a fucking dumpster. Tim, Tim. <laughs> what? Really what? Hurts. She smells like a dumpster. Tim. Yeah. I know. I know you've been on this uh, truth telling kick. Yeah. It's and too much. You tell the truth to everyone you meet, so they tell you the truth back. Oh, well, she's telling you the truth back right now, and how does that truth make you feel, Tim? Uh, it sounds like bullshit to me. She still smells like garbage. Okay. <laughs> Tim, you hired me as, as an ombuds person. Yeah. For, for you and Melanie to, to make, make amends, okay? Tim, you have enough money to hire an ombuds person. I've been asking you for a while to borrow just a little bit to install a shower in my house. That's not a good usage of your money. Listen, you gotta teach a man to fish or some shit like that. No. Alright? If I just get you a shower, like, hey, shut up. what's gonna happen? You know for a fact that my shower head got confiscated because I couldn't pay my rent. <laughs> they came in and they confiscated my shower. You knew that for shower. a fact, Tim, remember? I did, I did in you fact know, know that. that. I did in fact know that. And I have no way of showering, so of course, of course I but smell like garbage. You know what, I just wanna go back and break that down a little bit though, because I just, Thinking about it, why didn't they just shut your water off? <laughs> why did they we cut to the, the scene where her shower head gets confiscated. Oh, uh, so miss, no, uh, I'm gonna have to take that. No, please. I'm gonna have to take that Kohler please. shower head. Don't. I'm gonna have to take it. <laughs> please. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get a second job. No, please. no. I this have an is the last in. fixture in your house, and we need it. <laughs> Okay, you either give me $23 that you owe a Home no, Depot, or I'm going to take this Kohler shower head back. This is the L360 series. You this know, is a treasure. You know I don't have it. Please, I'll get a second job. I have an application in. I'll be a really great nope, leader. Nope. nope. Nope, I'm sorry. This hurts me more than it hurts you. How is that possible? Here, 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 here. I'm taking it down right now. I'm watching you have This to is the sound of a shower head being taken. Get, oh, your, door. Get your door. Get your door. Yeah, hi. Uh, yeah, I gotta take these doorknobs. No! Yeah, I'm sorry, I gotta take the no, doorknobs. No, please, I have an application in. Uh, I'm nah. gonna be a waiter at Tex Mex if they hire me. Yep, well, you're also gonna be someone without doorknobs, so <laughs> tough shit. What am, what am I supposed to do? Uh, pay your bills. <laughs> That's a really good point. It's a really good point. I can't, though. Have you heard of the free market economy? 
<laughs> Do you know what the free market economy is? Yeah, I own a small business. <laughs> You'd understand. And you see him, you see him like take all the doorknobs and he goes back to his small business called uh, <laughs> doorknobs and stuff. And it's like doorknobs and like a ton of stuff. And he's just there and he's just like, like paging through them and stroking them quietly. I love doorknobs. <laughs> doorknobs are my life. I live for this. Hi, I'm here for my internship. Whoa, I didn't see you there. <laughs> oh, sorry. I sneak up sometimes. Yeah, no joke. Hi, um, I'm I didn't see you hiding behind all my stuff. <laughs> oh, yeah, there's a lot of stuff here. Yep. Yeah, this is weird. I couldn't, like, quite characterize what it is. I'm like, is this kitchen appliances? Is it... Living room furniture? No, it's just stuff. Yeah, it's just stuff. Yeah. Knickknacks, things, things of that regard. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's why I'm really excited to like learn more about stuff in my internship. <laughs> yeah. I'm glad you responded to my Craigslist ad. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. I mean, I never thought I'd meet somebody who loves doorknobs as much as I do. You love doorknobs? Yeah. I really love doorknobs. <laughs> well, I really like uh, Schleg. Oh my god, Schleg? Yeah, that's my like that's absolute only, favorite. Yeah, it's only the premier German doorknob manufacturing. Yeah. Oh my god, wow. Um, yeah, I already feel like I'm learning so much through this internship. Great. I'm glad you're here. Yeah. Uh, do you mind uh, coming into the back for a second? <laughs> I have some inventory that I need to move. This is oh, okay, nothing, okay, this okay, is nothing okay, weird. Okay. Thanks so much for playing that. nothing yeah, weird. Yeah. Listen, I know you found me on Craigslist, yeah, but no. it's nothing weird. Yeah, I just wanted to, yeah, because I'm actually trained as an ombudsperson, so <laughs> I, I wanted to, like, make sure we had that cleared up before I... Got it. Because okay. that's like the ombudsperson motto, clear it up. Got it, got it. Yeah. I don't want to freak you out, but I do have some other employees in the back that are chained up. <laughs> okay, um... Why? <laughs> well, come on, let's just okay, go. Let's, let's just go, go in the back. Let's go okay. in the back. Yeah. people always try new things. Yep. Hi, <laughs> welcome to doorknobs and stuff. Can I get you anything that's within arm's reach? <laughs> <laughs> and see. <laughs> Can we get another word? Crease. What was that? Crease. 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 Uh, so crease makes me think of um, like paper airplanes, uh, which makes me think of like things that most people can do that I can't. <laughs> so I uh, I don't under like much like I don't know how to uh, like make a, a paper airplane. I've never learned those skills. Um, I also can't roll my R's. And so growing up, this was something that like my sister took great pleasure in because there was like an ad when we were kids. Do you remember this? Like, the Ruffles Have Ridges ads? And it was like, Ruffles Have Ridges. But it's all like like that. It's, it's rolled. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's yeah, totally yeah. rolled. I couldn't do it. Um, I'm like, I don't know why as a kid, the fact that like my sister would torment me with this would like affect me so much. Because it's like something that genetically you could do or not do. Like it's not, I don't think it's something you could train your tongue to do. Is it? I don't think it is. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not gonna tell you that I trained my tongue to do Did it. Did you? Oh man. I took high school school Spanish. Yeah. I also took high school Spanish and it was not effective because no. I I mean, it was all effective because I also couldn't speak Spanish. Can, can you just uh, oblige and just try yeah. real quick? All right, yeah. hold on to your butts. Here we go. Say rotunda. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> just, 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 yeah, just stop there. Just stop there. We're good. We're good. <laughs> stop doing that, Brennan. Stop. You know that makes me feel inadequate. I, I just wasn't born with a hitchhiker's thumb like you. I just... <laughs> I wasn't born with a hitchhiker's thumb. Excuse me. What? I'm sorry. I didn't I wasn't that. born with it. Do you know how hard I've worked to get it this pointy? Do you have any idea the self-sacrifices no. I have made to make my thumb go on a perpendicular angle to the rest of my fist? Do you have any concept? I thought that was just something you were born with. I thought it was a genetic thing. No. Like a recessive trait or... Look at my left hand. Okay. And now look at my right hand. Okay. They're not the same. No. One of them put in the work and the other one did not. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Your right thumb, your right thumb is erect and straight. Mm-hmm. 
Hey, uh, sorry to interrupt. I just wanted to say welcome to TGI Fridays. Uh, all the uh, loaded potato skins. Uh, can I get you guys anything to drink to yeah. get started? Hey, uh, Donnie, Ye is it? Yep, that's what the name tag says, Donnie. Donnie, can I ask you a question? Sure. How hard do you think it is to make your thumb perfect? You don't have to answer that, Donnie. Donnie, you, you should answer what do you, it. What do you mean by perfect? Well, look at my thumb. Holy shit. <laughs> that is perfect. That's what I'm saying. I've literally never seen a thumb that looks that erect. <laughs> how much work do you think it, how much work do you think went into it? On a scale of one to ten, how much work? I don't, I honestly don't know. Maybe like a, a nine? Mm, close, not quite. <laughs> Is it an, an, an eight? No, wrong. Hey, Donnie? Yeah. Whoa. Donnie. Put, put that thing down. Donnie, you try. No, no. It needs to go up. It needs to go up. Got Fire. it. I got it. Yeah. It's just, it's intimidating. Stop brandishing your thumb at him. Yeah. I'm just saying, I just want to be clear about the type of commitment I make to things. So if you want in on this, let me know. Okay, look. Can we just order our drinks? Yeah. <laughs> First. Okay, two two Bud Lights. Okay. Mm, I'll have a margarita. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right. I'll, uh, I'll be right back with us. Hold on just one second. <laughs> look, I like you. I'm going to be clear. Yeah. I like you. I don't pull this out for everybody. Yeah. I just... I, I know like, you usually leave gloves on mm -hmm. so that people can't see them. You told me all about that. I don't want to be intimidate people. <laughs> I'm like a sexual giant. <laughs> what? <laughs> Your thumbs are sexual giants? Or no, like, no, I. You're a sexual giant. I am a oh sexual God, um, giant. Okay, so this. Yeah. The state just took a turn. Yeah. <laughs> a full 180, uh, if you will. Here are your uh, two Bud Lights and a margarita. <laughs> hey, Donnie, can I ask you a question? Shoot. You don't have to answer that, Donnie. Donnie, <laughs> Donnie if you were to hear the term sexual giant. You know what? what? I, You know, I'm neglecting my other tables. I'll be right back. <laughs> uh, can we order apps? Uh, hang on just one second. Okay. I need to take a breather. <laughs> I did that to him. <laughs> you, fucked, you fucked his mind. <laughs> I you fucked, fucked his, his mind I, all the way away from our table. I fucked his mind away from our oh table. My God. I'm simultaneously scared and turned on and 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 still ashamed of my thumbs. No, hey. Hi, my name's Kenneth. Sorry to interrupt. Uh, I just wanted to come over real quick. Uh, Donnie sent me over. He needed to take a little bit of a break. Can I get you guys some appetizers? Can you, Kenneth? I don't know what that means. Of course I can. I'm your, I'm your waiter. Yeah. But can you? Jesus Christ, look at those thumbs. <laughs> Just one. Just one. Look at the left hand. Good God. Big difference. I like you. I'm going to be honest. Yeah. Kenneth, I'm not. I'm talking through you. Sorry. Yeah. You're just in the way. I'll Kenneth. come back. Yeah. <laughs> I'm back. You like me even despite my normal thumbs and... I'm not quite a sexual giant, more like a sexual normal height person. This is, this is what I'm trying to say, though. Uh huh. I didn't have these thumbs at the beginning. When I was a child, I was not a sexual giant. I grew into both of those things in a non-gross way, because maturing is a part of life. <laughs> Hold on, let me finish my first Bud Light. Okay. You have Quite a gulping mechanism. Yeah. I drink really fast. Yeah. I actually trained myself to do that. Oh. Um, <laughs> nice. Yeah. <laughs> and see. <laughs> uh, can we get can we get one more word? Platonic. Platonic. Uh, so platonic makes me think of um, every relationship I've been in. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, but more, more specifically, um, there was this guy I was like in love with in high school, and his name was uh, his name was Matt Becker. Hi, Matt! Surprise! Um, he's gonna watch this. Uh, <laughs> Matt Becker is gonna watch that. <laughs> Matt Becker is gonna watch it. Uh, and he, I had like such a crush on him. Um, we we're really good friends, and we took 
our sophomore year, we had almost every class together. So we'd go from like first period all the way to like seventh period together. Uh, and it was around the time of the winter ball, which is what our winter dance was called. And I was like, I'm going to ask Matt Becker out, uh, which was like, for me, really brazen. Cause like, I, I'm not good with gentlemen. Um, <laughs> even though at the time he was a 16 year old kid, uh, as was I, um, I'm like, I'm going to ask out Matt Becker to this winter ball. Uh, and I, I was like gearing myself up and gearing myself up and he, he wrote poetry, uh, which is one of the things I liked about him. And he comes into Spanish class one day and he's like, I wrote a poem last night and I would love your opinion. So he slides it over to the, across the desk to me and I read it and class starts and the poem says something to the fact of like, I like you so much. It, it rhymed. It was much more poetic than this, but it was like, I like you so much. I think you're amazing. I want to, I want to spend time with you, but please don't ask me to the winter ball. I won't be going to it. And I was just, and it was just like this beautiful poem with this really sad ending. Uh, and class starts and now we leave to go to our next class. And I was like, Matt, how, like, and he's like, what do you think of the poem? I was like, I really liked it. I was just wondering, like, how you knew I was about to ask you to the winter ball. <laughs> well, uh, and he goes, oh, what? That poem wasn't about you. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah. Oh, no. And he's married. He's now married. He has two beautiful children. Hi, Matt. Hi, Hi Matt. Matt. <laughs> so. My dearest Kelsey, it is I. Michael Schlecker from fourth period. Mine's second and third period as well. Michael, what's what's, what's wrong with your voice? <laughs> oh, no. oh, sorry. Sometimes my voice is cracking. Oh. I'm hitting puberty, and so sometimes I talk like a gentleman, but sometimes yeah. I talk I'm like a boy. Okay, I'm still on board. No. Oh. Um, my dearest Kelsey, may I read you a sonnet that I have prepared? Sure. Dad, can you leave the room? <laughs> yeah, sure. Uh, just no touching, okay? Uh, thanks, Mr. Mr. Hagelsmith. Yeah, uh, yeah, okay. Whatever. Can you get us some jalapeno puppet from downstairs? <laughs> <laughs> you have... The worst choice in friends. I just Dad, you know. No, it's. Dad. I, I mean no offense by that, but you're a weird kid. No, I'm taken. Dad, spicy food's the in the thing now. Right, I'll go All the kids are eating yep, it. Yeah, I'm going to get the jalapeno poppers. Hang on one second. Great. He's gone. Uh, good. <laughs> Dearest Kelsey, may I take you to the winter ball? The fairest occasion of them all. It we rhymes. could go to the mall first. Oh, slight rhyme. Maybe eat at Jamba Juice or worst. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> like where? Is, is it? Is it? Did you like it so far? Yeah, I didn't know if there was more. Oh, oh yeah, there's more. Yeah. Uh, I would like to hold your hand <laughs> and maybe be your gentleman or boy. Oh, um, Michael, I. I don't know what to say. I mean, you know how much I love Jamba Juice and how I think there's very few things in the world worse than that. I just... Oh no, sorry, this is this is actually just, this is from Mrs. Decker. This poem's from Mrs. Decker. <laughs> it starts with my name. Yeah. <laughs> I wanted to give you a flavor, I wanted to give you a real feeling for how it would be to be addressed in that way with the sonnet. Yeah, you know? first off, Michael, that's not a that's not a sonnet. Sonnets have rules. Oh, it's four, fourteen lines, and it changes between lines eight and nine. So that's irregardless. But I I, I thought that, that Shakespeare said that rules are for little pussy boys. <laughs> Did I just hear what I think I just heard? Dad! I was listening outside. I'm not gonna lie. Dad, you're supposed to be making the help you poppers. Listen, we don't have any. I went down and checked. <laughs> All we got is fucking dinosaur chicken nuggets. I'm sorry, Mr. I'm sorry, Mr. Hicklesmith. I thought it was because you worked at TGI Fridays that you had a, a, unlimited access to jalapeno poppers. Yeah, you know what? That's about the dumbest fucking thing I've ever heard. Hang on one second. Let's let's break through this. Real I'm used quick. to saying the dumbest fucking things people's ever heard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hang on. Slow down. You slow your roll. Listen, what do your parents do for a living? 
my my dad used to be the head of Enron, and <laughs> my mom, my mom is a homemaker. All right. Well, she was. All right. I, I truthfully. She got a job. Don't worry. She didn't die. <laughs> All right. Truthfully, I don't really know how to deal with that, so I'm just gonna leave that on the table. I'm gonna assume your dad fucked a lot of people over, Whoa. much like myself. Oh, <laughs> over. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Sorry, Dad. I'm really into language. <laughs> Where in the hell did I go wrong? <laughs> Oh, oh, you were, you were, you went wrong because you were telling me why that was the stupidest thing you ever heard, and then you asked me what my parents did. Yeah, I mostly was just gonna say, like, just because I work at TGI Fridays doesn't mean that I'm gonna have jalapeno poppers. Like, I don't just come with, like, fucking poppers in my pockets. <laughs> my mom, my mom works at a, a doorknob store now. Oh, yeah? Which, which one? It's called Doorknobs and Stuff. You know, I've been there. That place is yeah. it, nice. It's got all kinds of stuff there. It got a lot of people chained up in the back. <laughs> hold up, hold up. What? Oh, oh shit, I'm not supposed to say that. Oh, oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Oh, oh, hey, oh. hey, 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 kid, stop hitting yourself. <laughs> Sometimes it's the only way I can make this voice go away. Okay. Listen, we got to talk about your friends. It doesn't matter. He explicitly came here to not ask me to a dance. Hey. He went out of his way to come here and not ask me to a dance. Mrs. Decker's a lunch lady, and sure, she's really good in that hair nap, but I'm a teenager. Michael, we're the same age. I like, I like how it looks like she's a fish who got caught. <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> you're just a pretty girl. What the fuck? And you don't look like you're a fish who got caught in a no. net. And you don't, you don't give me, you don't give me meatloaf. Honestly, I need you to like get the fuck out of my house. One and two, we gotta have a talk. Uh, can I? May, may I take this doorknob for my mother? No, no, this is our doorknob. Get the hell out of here. Just go. I bid you adieu. <laughs> I'm gonna die alone, aren't I? <sighs> I mean, maybe. <laughs> 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 <laughs>